guys, Kendra. So, Kelsey and I are getting ready to leave. Um, I want to show you guys my makeup because I tried out the Morphe 350 palette today. And I love it already. The colors are like really pigmented. It's a little bit of fallout, but it's not a big deal because they're so pigmented and like so pretty. Um, I'm just wearing three of the colors today. And I'm obsessed. I am going to do like a makeup tutorial with the palette. I don't know what yet, but I am going to do a look with it. But I just wanted to, you know, try it out today and see how the colors wear. But I'm liking it so far. Um, if you guys are wondering what highlight I'm wearing, it's Global Glow by MAC. I'm obsessed with that highlighter. Like, I have never, I don't think I have a highlighter for MAC. And Global Glow is really nice. Um, it's like in a, it's like the mineralized ones. They're like baked. So I love Global Glow. And on my lips, I'm trying out, um... Obviously, I mixed it with chestnut. It's the melted chocolate milkshake or something, the peachier one. But I just mixed it with chestnut because I wanted it to be more brown from Too Faced. Um, so I'm wearing the melted uh, chocolate melted liquid lipstick. I don't know. I probably got the name so wrong. But y'all know what I'm talking about. I mixed it with chestnut by MAC. So that's what I'm wearing. Uh, my hair is in a ponytail today because I'm going to wash it today later on. And I'm going to film my hair routine today. So... That's going to be an all night process. I already know. Because it's already. It already takes like two hours to do my hair. So filming it is probably going to take longer. So I'm going to do that tonight. Um, I took a picture of my outfit. I'll probably post it on Instagram. But I'm just really casual. So this is what I'm wearing. I'm wearing my Nike Roches. Um, I get a lot of questions about these. These are Nike IDs. I did them myself. I did just means that they're customized. I got them off of Nike's website. So wearing these are super comfortable. These jeans are from American Eagle. This shirt is from Target. And this bomber is from Fashion Nova. So that's what I'm wearing today. We're at the mall. Going in. I don't want a lot of people here because the parking lot's empty. Kelsey found a good parking spot. And I just got done filming the last part of my hair routine video. I was filming the intro and outro part, like the modeling, you know, part. Um, so I just got done doing that. I just did my makeup quick for that. I'm not wearing any lashes or anything because I don't feel like doing all that. And I don't know if I'm going to edit this today because it's not going up this week. It's actually going up next week. I don't know if I should or not. I'm trying to debate whether or not I should go ahead and edit it and like save it and stuff just to get it out of the way. I think I'll probably go ahead and edit it. But today's Tuesday, so that means we're going to be watching Pretty Little Liars because the five years forward is back. Let me know if this is just me. I'm trying to get used to the fact that they're not teenagers anymore because it's an adjustment. We've seen them as teenagers for so many years on the show that we have to get used to them being grown on the show now. You know, like full adults now. So it's kind of weird, but I still like the fact that they're adults now. I do like that. But... I'm trying to get my mind wrapped around like there's no more Caleb and there's no more Spoby. If you guys don't know Hannah and Caleb or Spencer and Toby, like neither one of them are together anymore. So it's kind of weird not seeing them together because I love Hannah and Caleb together. So it's a little awkward. But if you guys are wondering what's on my lips, I'm wearing Lolita, the original Lolita and Lolita 2 over top of that. So that's what I'm wearing now. I really like it. And then on my eyes, I'm just wearing the Too Faced Semi-Sweet Chocolate Bar Palette. And my foundation is the Makeup Forever HD Foundation. And I feel so much better since my hair is clean and just fresh and nice. But yeah, I'm going to import this footage and hopefully get it done. Get done editing this tonight and then I can just save it and be ready to upload for when it's supposed to go up. So, yeah. Hi guys. So, it is Thursday. And I just got done filming a video. I just got done filming an empties video. And it's going up tomorrow. Um, so I'm going to edit that tonight. But I'm just waiting on Kendra to use the computer. Because she's finishing up editing a video that goes up next week. So I just thought I'd get on here and talk to you guys. I think I'm going to sit this down. Okay, this might be creaky, but that's good enough. Tomorrow, Kendra and I are going to a spin class. So we're going to a soul cycle class. 
This is gonna be our first one, so I'm kind of nervous. I heard you sweat a lot. I mean, you guys are wondering what we do to our hair when we work out because we usually work out at home. I just leave my hair wrapped because ain't nobody looking at me. But if I'm going somewhere out in public where I'm working out, I like to put my hair in a ponytail and put it like on a headband because um, the headband just pretty much helps my edges not to sweat out while I'm working out. But other than that, I just leave it wrapped. And of course, when my hair is curly, it don't really matter if I sweat because it's curly. So we're going to go do that. I think the class is around like five. And then tomorrow night, Keisha and Kai are going to come over here. We're just going to have a girls night in. We're not going to be doing much. Just watching some movies, having some wine. Well, Keisha, Kai doesn't drink. But we're going to be having some wine and watching some movies and just talking about life like we usually do when we get together. And then next week, I have to do my friend's hair, my friend Claudia because it's going to be her birthday. I mean, I do her hair anyway. Um, a lot of people ask me and Kendra if we still do hair. Um, not really. Um, I'll do some of my friends if they ask me, but other than that, YouTube takes pretty much uh, most of our time. So we're going to go to her birthday dinner, and then she's going out afterwards. Uh, I think she said sh she told me she's going to opera, so we're going to be going to opera. I'm not going to vlog in there, just because, first of all, I don't want to lose this camera because it costs too much money. Um, me and Kendra never vlog when we go out, which is not too often because we're not club people we prefer to go to dinner have drinks because i like to talk with my friends and have a conversation if i do go somewhere it's like a bar or something because i like to watch the game but yeah it should be pretty fun <sighs> kendra still editing her video she's doing her voiceover she likes to do her voiceovers in the closet because it's really quiet in there it's not a lot of background noise i think that's all i want to tell y'all just want to come on and talk to y'all for a minute but I was reading some um, messages on my Snapchat. You guys are like so sweet. You're so supportive. I just want to thank you guys for being so supportive with both of our channels. Because a lot of people said that they will still watch our vlogs no matter how long or short they are. So we just thank you guys for being so supportive. It just means a lot. So thank you, thank you, thank you. And we love you guys. To the moon and back. That's why we decided to incorporate Twin Talk into our vlog channel. I'm not sure how many of you are still here listening to me talk. But thank you for listening. Hey guys, it's Kendra. So I'm in my room right now and the lighting is probably awful right now. It's Friday and Keisha and Kai are getting ready to come over. We're gonna have a girls night. And I just put on like minimal makeup. Well, this is minimal for me. Um, this lighting is making me look like really washed out right now. Kelsey is getting ready to order a pizza. Um, I think Keisha and Kai are gonna be here in like 20 minutes or so, 15 minutes, I'm not sure. But yeah, they're on the way here. Um, but yeah, I did put some makeup on so I can look halfway decent, even though I'm just going to be chilling at the house. So this is my outfit of the night. This is what I'm wearing. These sweats are from TJ Maxx and they're really comfy. My house shoes are from Target. Sweatshirt is from Forever 21 and it's like a nude color, like a nudie peach color, but you clearly can't see that with this lighting in my room, but that's okay. It's from Forever 21. So yeah, this is what I'm wearing. Um, I just wanted to be comfy just because we're gonna just be chilling and probably watching some movies and of course talking, cause you know, we can do that for hours. Hey guys, it's Kendra. So today's Saturday and it's Saturday night actually. And Kelsey and I just got done filming a video for this channel. And it's a new series we're starting called Twin Talk. And it went well. The first one went well. It was a lot shorter than I thought it was going to be because Kelsey and I can talk forever. But it went well, actually. So hopefully you guys like these kind of videos. And like Kelsey said in the last video, we're going to be putting up two vlogs a month. So hopefully this one can be something extra for you guys to look forward to. We're going to try to do them once a month. So, yeah, we just got done filming that. But we're watching a movie on Lifetime tonight. It's called Leela and Eve with J-Lo and Viola Davis. I have been wanting to see that for a while, and it comes on Lifetime tonight. So we're going to watch that. I feel like this is the first Saturday night we haven't gone, like, out. Because we usually go out to dinner or something. Or, like, we're, we're not at home on Saturday nights usually. But we're home tonight. So that's fine, too. Keisha and Kai left this morning. But we had fun last night. We talked forever. I think we... I went to sleep at like 3.30 ish. It was like three something. So we talked a lot. And we watched two movies because we were talking too much after that. I'm really hot in front of these lights. So I'm gonna take these lights down and uh, take this makeup off so we can watch the movie. Oh, I wanna talk about Pretty Little Liars this past Tuesday. Y'all, I don't know. That's all I can really say right now because girl code. I just feel like Spencer like, well not Spencer. I'm blaming Marlena first. Cause she wrote it. Cause she wrote it. <laughs> then I'm blaming Hannah. Cause why you dump like one of the most perfect boyfriends on this show. 
And then three, I'm blaming Spencer because girl, you know better. That's your best friend. And like Kelsey said, girl code. Like you don't you don't do that. That ain't that ain't cool. Um, so I don't know. It's just like I don't know how I feel about five years forward so far. Maybe I did like them in high school better because apparently they were more loyal loyal to each other. So I don't know. But y'all let me know how y'all feel about the five years forward season because I don't know how I feel about it. But that doesn't mean I won't be re-watching other seasons because I still like the actual whole series like of the show. But I just don't know about this season right now. Not right now. Hey guys, it's Kendra. So today's Friday and Kelsey and I, well, I just got done getting ready and Kelsey's almost done getting ready. We're getting ready to go to the mall. What else is new? Um, Kelsey wanted to go to MAC because she doesn't have any lip glosses, like not as much as I do. And she wanted to um, get some glosses just to have just um, like everyday shades. She has like one or two lip glosses and she wanted to get the one that I always wear from MAC, um, the plush glass or something like that, plush gloss and power supply. So she wants to get that. Um, I'm not wearing it today, by the way. I am wearing Rambutan by Bite Beauty with Lolita 2 underneath. So um, that's the gloss that I'm wearing today. I don't really plan on getting anything in particular except I wanted to get a couple of MAC eyeshadows to add to my palette because my MAC eyeshadow palette is still not full because um, I have so many other eyeshadows that I always forget to finish filling that one up. So I think I want to get like two or three colors. So that's what I think I'm going to do. I don't, I don't need anything else for MAC. So I'm just going to get like three eyeshadows and be done because I don't need any, any makeup like that. Not that much. And we might go check our P.O. box um, like we normally do during the week. I guess I can tell you guys what makeup I'm wearing today. Um, foundation, I'm wearing Makeup Forever HD mixed with the Maybelline Matte and Poreless foundation. So I mixed those. those. I mixed those for the first time today and I actually really like it. The highlight I'm wearing is Rose Gold by Becca mixed with Global Glow by MAC. And my eyeshadows are MAC shadows. I'm just wearing brown script in my crease and saddle on my lid. The lashes I'm wearing are Car Lashes in number 43. My blush is Raisin by MAC. On my brows, I use the Brow Definer from Anastasia. That thing is amazing. Like, if you have not tried the Brow Definer from Anastasia Beverly Hills yet, you need it in your life. Like, it's amazing. Like, I finished my brow so fast. And I love the Brow Wiz too, but if you like a more bolder brow and you want to get them done faster, then I highly recommend the Brow Definer. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you guys, the Kylie Lip Kits came back in stock today. And I did get my hands on all three of them. Well, not literally, but... I was able to order all three and Kelsey only wanted one. She wanted True Brown K, so I ordered that one for her. And Kel I think Kelsey was still asleep when I ordered it, so I was already like on the computer, so I was like, might as well get Kelsey the color that she wanted because I was going to get her all three. But then when I went back, Dolce K and Candy K were both sold out because when I first went on the site, I went on there at like 11.59. Everything was there. So, and her new colors were on there, but I didn't really want the new colors. I wanted all three of her original shades that she came out with, which is Candy K, Dolce K, and True Brown K. So I got all three of those. And then after I did my order, I went and did Kelsey's. And then Candy K and Dolce K got sold out in like 10 minutes, which is kind of insane. But I was expecting it to sell out quicker, actually, because 10 minutes is a long time compared to the first time she came out with these. And they sold out in like seconds, which is insane. I actually think that she did get like more in stock because last time they did go faster than this time. But I was still happy I got my hands on all three. So I'll be wearing those when they come in. I'm really excited to see like the formula because I've been hearing a lot of good things about them because I've like watched reviews and stuff like that. So... So Kelsey and I just got back from the mall. Um, we actually stopped by Starbucks after the mall though because we want some chai. This is an iced chai. Um, because it's like our favorite drink at Starbucks. I want to show you guys what I got from MAC really quick, just in case you're curious. I did get the shadows that I was looking for, except for one because I didn't have it. 
They didn't have this color called Mythology. And I think I got a clip of it in the store. Yeah, I think I got a clip of it in the store. Um, it was like a pretty rose gold color. And it had like little sparkles in it. Oh, I'm going to have to order it online because it was so pretty. But um, I did get the other colors that I was looking for. I put these in my MAC palette. I have like seven empty spaces for shadows to go in. But I only got five. Well, technically, I would have had six if um, they had the other color available. And I did get one lip gloss, even though I wasn't supposed to get it. So. Okay, so the first color I got is this color. It's called Bamboo, and it's like a medium, like, vanilla shade. It's like a beige vanilla shade, so that's what that looks like. And I got this color. It's called Ground Brown, and it's like a dark brown. I don't have a matte dark brown for MAC, so... This one was really pretty. And then I also got Rule. This is like a medium orange color. Um, it kind of reminds me of Caramel from Anastasia. Kelsey thought so too. Um, we both got this shade. I think Kelsey got two of these because she really likes these kind of colors. And then this next color is Red Brick. I'm obsessed with this color. It's just like it says a red brick shade. And I'm just so excited to use this with like warm tone looks. This looks like exactly like one of the colors in the morphe 350 palette um they have a color like this in there but i just wanted one for my mac palette and then the last shade that i got is honey lust this is the only shimmery shade that i got i would have got two but they didn't have mythology so i just got this one and then i got this lip gloss this is one of their lip glasses i wasn't supposed to get this kelsey was supposed to be the only one getting a lip gloss but um i saw it in the store and i swatched it and i had to have it this is called Spice. So that's what that looks like. Um, it's not showing up that true to color on camera with my vanity light. But in person it's like a medium browny nude kind of shade. I love like um, nudes with brown and peach undertones. So that's why I feel like I needed this. I swatched it on my hand so that's how I can tell if it goes pretty with my skin tone. So yes, I'm going to love this. And you guys will probably see this in like a favors or you know a tutorial or something eventually so yes got that oh, i also wanted to show you guys this uh brush holder that i got from amazon because the bath and body works um containers that i use to store my brushes in were kind of annoying me because those beads that i had in it were falling out and i just wanted like a new setup for my brushes like not new setup but new storage for my brushes so i'm going to show you guys that right quick okay so this is the little um container that i was talking about this is from amazon and it's from a company called boho boohoo collection i'm probably butchering that but i got it from amazon and it's called like a brush holder caddy or something this is like consider like a caddy kind of like you know like a shower caddy this is kind of that for your brushes and i just um got it because i just thought it looked so so cool i actually saw this on amy macedo's um channel one of her videos i think i don't know if it was her vlog channel or her beauty channel it was probably both but yes um she linked this in the description box um and it was from amazon so i just went ahead and got it right then it was like 15 or 16 dollars it wasn't even that expensive and this is like really good quality and like you can fit so many brushes in here i have two sets of face brushes over here and then two sets of eye brushes over here this is just how i'm organizing it right now i mean i guess it makes the most sense and i still have room for more eye brushes not sure about face brushes because i have a lot of face brushes but yeah if you're looking for anything new to hold your brushes this is really good um so i really like this i actually thought it was going to come with like three of these little compartment things but it actually came with four when it came in the mail so i was happy about that so i'm just leaving it like over here for right now because i don't know where to put it right now because my vanity is not organized at all so i just thought it could just go there for now so yeah i wanted to show you guys that Hi guys, so it's Saturday, um, it's Saturday night actually, and Kendra and I are about to go to our friend's birthday dinner, and we're going to go out later. And we're almost ready. I was rushing to do my hair, but I think it turned out pretty good. I just like used the really fat wand and like curled it really quickly. And I'm obsessed with this new lip combo. This is Chestnut by MAC, and this is called a lip foundation. So it's Buxom Lip Foundation um, and Bare, and then I just topped it off with MAC's 
plush glass in power supply because I haven't worn a gloss in a while and I think it's really pretty. And if you guys are wondering what highlighter I'm wearing, this is Gilded Honey by Laura Geller. Yeah, and these lashes are Risqué Lashes by Coco Lashes. So yeah, this is just a dress I'm wearing. I'm gonna post a picture, of course, on Instagram so you guys will already have seen what I'm wearing. 